everyone, my name is Emily Perry. I'm going to be demonstrating a secondary infusion. I would look at the, um, the MAR and then the orders. It says that there's an order for vancomycin, one gram IV every 12 hours. With vancomycin, we would watch for red man syndrome as well as kidney function. So we're going to be looking at the creatinine levels and we're going to monitor the patient for any swelling or trouble breathing. I have all of my supplies, so I'm going to knock, perform hand hygiene. Hello, my name is Emily, I'm back. I'm going to be your nurse today. Can I get your name and date of birth? This is Kent Waters, 4774, and you, don't ha you only have allergies to penicillin, correct? Yes, so fortunately for us, we're going to be doing vancomycin. Um, this drug, can have some side effects, so I need you to let me know if you're going to be having any um, rash on your chest, as well as any trouble breathing. Um, we're going to be watching your eyes and nose, as well as your kidney function. Um, so if you could let me know if you have any trouble breathing, I would appreciate it. I will also come back in 30 minutes after starting the infusion to check on my patient. I am going to take out my vancomycin and my secondary tubing and I'm going to back prime my tubing with um, this infusion. I'm going to make sure we're not clamped and then this has a cure roll on it so we do not need to alcohol swab. However, this is not um, capped so I'm going to go ahead and alcohol swab this. Just in case. For 10 to 15 seconds, I'm going to take my Kiro off. And then going to allow the drip chamber to fill halfway, at least halfway while um, letting all the air pockets release and we are getting more than halfway. <laughs> but now we don't have any air in our line. So we're gonna go ahead and squeeze some of that out just because we don't need all of that in there. And I need to observe um, the dripping in the drip chamber. Going to now swipe my bag. And then we're going to allow gravity to do this for us. And now I'm going to start a secondary infusion. So I'm trying to select. Secondary, we are doing at 133 an hour. And this is a 200 ml bag, so we're gonna do 210 because we wanna make sure the entire bag gets infused. And then once this is finished, my fluids will take over again. Going to make sure I'm not clamped. And I'm going to press start. Going to observe the drip chamber, we are dripping going to add my medication label of this is Mr. Kent Waters and we're doing Banco. Amount is one gram for 200 ml. Going to initial. It was started at 9.55 on 9.16 and I'm going to place this on the back top of the bag and then my change tubing on 916 it was placed at 955 in my initials and place this just below the drip chamber and I like I said I will come back in 30 minutes and observe um, my patient to make sure that he's not having any trouble breathing or any rash going to clean up my mess.
warm hand hygiene and then I would document that I started the vancomycin and antacid.